What's up YouTube? My name is Khalil, AKA Miles Morales. Today's video is gonna be a little bit different today. Um, I found this book that my mom got me when I was younger, when I was like, when I was first born. It's called A Book to Record Baby's First Years. So my mom took the time and did, don't worry about the mess with it, we're gonna clean it up later. But my mom took the time to do everything, like record everything I did my first year. And I read it, I thought it was pretty cool. I'm gonna share it with you guys. Not too much information, but I'm gonna show you like the funny parts and all the stuff that my mom wrote down there. So stick around. What you call an icon living? Start a record label, Miss Fish just did it. Boom. Nylon, couple five minutes. Whoa, we up too hot in the business. What you call an icon living? Start a record label, Miss Fish just did it. Boom. Nylon, couple five minutes. Whoa, we up too hot in the business. Okay, so here's the book. I don't know if you guys can see it. All right. All right, so I'm reading to you, grandmother, and mom in the background. So, as I was saying, the story begins, there once was a kid named Khalil, the most cutest, best dude, best man in this world. And, okay, let's stop, let's, let's stop for a little bit. Okay, um, Okay, so page number one. I can't, I'm not gonna read everything because I don't want not too much detail out there, but I'll just read what this what this is saying right here, right? So P is for parents. Your mommy's full name. We're not saying her full name, we're just gonna say her first and last name. Melanie Hackett. Daddy's first name. I'm not gonna say daddy. That's weird. I'll say mommy, but I'm not saying dad. Dad. Dad's full name. Donnie Mignon. All right, it's the only time I'm gonna say their names like that. The rest of the time I'm gonna say dad and mom. It doesn't feel right for me to do that, All right? Anyways, when they found out, when my mom found out I was coming, it says here, I was so happy I couldn't believe it. It was on June 17th, 1998. Guess what year I was born. Um, I kept buying home pregnancy tests to make sure before I went to the doctor. Sounds boring. Let's skip to some of the good stuff. All right. Uh, we're scrolling, we're scrolling. Oh, look at my little feet. I did that. I did that, look at that. Little feet and my hands. I messed it up, I probably was like crawling and stepping on stuff here, but um, let's skip, skip. Oh, there I was. Welcome to our world. I know I didn't say that, but that's what I wanted to say. All right, so, okay, let's see, let's do this. Family tree, my family tree's kind of big. Kind of big, kind of big, let's get through that. All right, so here we go, we'll start here. Happy to be home. I came home March 3rd, 1999. Uh, we lived and stayed with my great grandmother until we found our own home. Pretty cool, right? No? Okay, never mind. <laughs> uh, anyways, the world. Local events that were happening at my time when I was born. Black History Month, Bill Clinton was president, the economy recovering, popular TV shows, Melrose Place. I don't know if anybody knows that show. I don't even know that show. I know my mom knows it, but I don't know if anybody knows that show. Um, music groups, Busta Rhymes, Jay-Z, and Monique. I don't know who Monique is, but I know the other two. Popular songs, The Boy Is Mine, Who Am I? Another song I don't really know. Around You. Okay, so famous actors and actress. So I'm assuming this is my mom's favorite actors and actress. And all she put down here was Nicolas Cage at that time. Nicolas Cage, my mom loves Nicolas Cage. Like the movies out there, she loves Nicolas Cage. Ain't that right, mom? Yes, sir. Yeah, exactly, see? She can't even deny. Um, sports figure. It's like meant to be because I, Michael Jordan is my favorite um, NBA player. Yeah, NBA player. So sports figure, Michael Jordan. Fashion trend, um, Capri pants. Popular movies, <coughs> Black Mass. Are you okay, mom? Need some water? Are you sure about that? I can get it. <laughs> Anyways, Black Mask, Life, and the military. Yeah. Anywho, sunny days. What we fed you, they fed me milk. That's all I'm, I'm gonna say that. I'm not gonna say what says here. They fed me milk, um, formula milk and some other milk, but that's it. Um, 
how often have did you eat so apparently i ate four times four to six times a day so let's multiply that by um let's say 10 i'm just kidding not that much i eat 10 times a day now literally and where does it all go you may ask we'll have that in another story time talk um songs we would sing jesus loves you you are my sunshine i actually like that song it's all good it's probably came into me like that but uh nicknames for you pumpkin munchkin my love honey little panther it should have been spider-man because you know i'm spider yeah i'm spider-man right you guys should have little panther is making me seem more like the black panther well i don't i don't mind black panther but you know yeah, yeah whatever uh <laughs> you smiled when you guys kissed my lips Ugh. um made funny sounds i still laugh when you guys make funny sounds when i talk oh when you talk to me i would smile and laugh you laughed when i was sleeping If a child is laughing when they're sleeping, what do you think? What is going through that child's head? What was going through my head when I was sleeping? Yeah, so <laughs> yeah grandma, that's exactly what happens. Um, I, uh, I laughed um, when you kissed my feet and tummy. Uh, um, when you opened your mouth and pretended to eat my nose, oh, I would have cried. I still might cry if my mom did that. Sweet dreams, little one. How we put you to bed, gave you a bath, and held you in our arms. Aw. Uh -huh. Don't try that now. Yeah, I am too big, man. Uh, when couldn't, when, when, uh, try it again. When you couldn't sleep, we would rock you or walk with you. When you're, uh, again, why can't I, not? I can't speak. All this acting and scripting and all stuff I do. But, um,. When you first slept through the night, you were five weeks old. That's pretty cool. Five weeks old? Pretty good kid, though. <coughs> pretty good kid. Bedtime stories. We would tell you, just be nice and get ready for bed. Now, I don't know what you guys think a bedtime story is. I hope your bedtime stories were a lot nicer than mine. Because literally, my mom just basically wrote down here. They told me, just be nice go to bed that was my bedtime story there was no cat in the hat there was no green eggs and ham there was no winnie the pooh there was not even hey you twinkle twinkle little star how i wonder <coughs> what you are there you go grandma there was never that it was just be nice and go to bed that's what my mom told me um toys you would sleep with tigger and winnie the pooh hence the book hence the, the winnie the pooh all right, so lullabies or music that made you fall asleep. Wow, it's like I'm a psychic. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. And natural sounds. <laughs> Crazy, okay. Doctor's appointment, we don't need to know that. Oh, bother, my... Oh, shots, we don't need to know that. Oh, what I did best. So here, here's the good part, guys. Here's the good part. <coughs> what I did best. When you were first... Oh, sorry, when you were first. Let's rewind that. When you first smiled, you were two months old. Slept through the night at one month. Held the bottle June 19, 1999. Held for 15 seconds. I hold the world's record. Nah, I'm just kidding. I don't know what the world's record is, but 15 seconds. Yo, what is this guy doing in there? He's making a whole lot of noise. No, he's playing some game, Mom. Uh... Rolled over. I rolled over at June on June 20, 21st, 1999. You were almost four months old. Crawled. You learned to crawl by myself. I crawled by myself. Sat up. June 30th, you were four months old on September 6th. Wow. Laughed. Two months. Stood up. September 8th. And couldn't stop doing it since. Took your first step. October 5th. Took your first step alone at Grandma's house, November twelfth. Waved by December nineteenth. <laughs> Waved by December 29th. It's waving bye to Grandma, saying bye bye. Wow, Grandma said bye bye to you. That was my first. That was probably my first word, wasn't it? 
Um, said mama and dada. September 2nd, I said mama. September 16th, I said dada. I felt so weird saying, by the way. Um, walked November 30th, 1999, when you were in Atlanta. Held a cup on November 6th. Ate solid food at seven months. Bat bathed in the tub March 17th. Your first pair of shoes was given by your grandmother July 17th. And my first pair of shoes were Jordans. Give me one second. I'm gonna go pick it up. Here is the shoe that my grandmother gave me. I only have one pair. I don't know where the other one is. This is the first shoe I ever had. Or yeah, these are the, sorry. Yeah, well let's say let's say shoes, but this, there's only one here. These are the first pair of shoes I ever had, and they were Jordans. My great grandmother bought me these, and I still have the sock to go with it. I had some like long feet, Ooh. but uh, yeah, these these are the shoes that um, I first wore ever. It's crazy. So favorite things to do. Well, favorite my well actually not favorite things to do. My favorite things basically when I was younger. Food, chips, chocolate. Loves McDonald's. That has not changed. I love chips. I love chocolate. Maybe I'm iffy on McDonald's, but here and then I get McDonald's. Yeah, my brothers, they're playing the 2K game, so let's, let's not worry about that. Screaming like a little girl. I don't know, these, these, these guys are weird. Um, toys, Winnie the Pooh and Tigger. Games, Nintendo Pokemon games. I love Pokemon when I was younger. I love Pokemon. I really thought Pokemon were real. Like, I saw a squirrel, and my mom bought me this Pokeball, right? I used to go outside and throw the Pokeball at the squirrel and try to catch it, but the squirrel was too fast. And when I threw it, the Pokeball would open and it would never close. So I was like, ah, man, this Pokeball is broken. So I tried to convince my mom to get another Pokeball. It didn't work out because I think she found out what I was doing. I love you too, mom. Uh, songs. I love Barney songs. Wow. Yeah, Barney, Barney. Yeah, Barney songs. Yeah, that's, that's pretty crazy. I love Barney songs. Okay, let's keep going. Let's keep going. One is wonderful, your first birthday. How we celebrated your birthday. You had a party at Chuck E. Cheese. You had a party with Auntie Sasha because you were born on the same day. Yes, me and my aunt were born on the same day. And it's funny because we have the same blood type too. Like we're the same blood type, everything. Same day, same minute, same time, it's crazy. We were born like literally exactly the same. Except she's a girl and I'm a guy. Point blank. Your birthday outfit, it was jean pants with striped shirts. I thought, I think you guys dressed me up as Tigger. The Tigger had stripes, right? The cake, the cake was chocolate and vanilla ice cream. I love chocolate and vanilla ice cream. It's, it's one of the best. It's, actually, it's not one, it is the best. It's the best ice cream out there. So yeah, if you guys ever wanna give me cake, which probably you guys will never will, but that's my favorite cake. Uh, your reaction, you were kind of a, oh, I was crying a lot because I wanted to run around and just be me. I didn't want to blow out no candles. I didn't want to play with people. I just wanted to run around trying to chase Chuck. Crazy. But then I got a little older, like when I was like three years old, I was scared of Chuck, which it really didn't make sense to me how this occurred, right? But anyways, gifts that they gave me, lots of outfits, Lego sets. I got a cell phone at one years old, man. Cell phone at one years old. I got the iPhone 28 6000 before anybody. Actually, iPhones weren't even made made at that time. Never mind. Let's just let's just scratch that. Let's just scratch that. Um, people that came, both grandmothers, great grandmother, dad, uncle, um, Nisia, um, a lot of people that you guys don't know. So I'm gonna stop naming them. And next page. Oh, nothing here. Daily loving care. We took care of you during the J. The J. Let's do that again. Daily loving again. Daily. I don't know what happened, but my camera gave out. Anyways, let's go quick. So as I was saying, babysitter, great grandmother, playmates, my cousin Tylo, and my aunt, Auntie Sasha. Uh, unforgettable story. As a baby, you were full of character. Hence why I'm an actor. I'm full of characters. I'm Will Smith. Um, I'm Michael B. Jordan Creed. I'm Spider-Man. I'm just a whole bunch of people. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Naming off stuff. You laughed when we tickled your legs. I hate when people tickle my legs. It feels weird. I don't understand 
how I laughed when I was younger. Now it just, it just feels a lot, it feels weird. I can't do it. Um, you cried when we would leave you alone for a long time. You can leave me alone anytime you want now, mom. Uh, <laughs> your cutest gesture was when you were hungry, you used to perk your lips up and clap your hands together. So basically, how I asked for food when I was younger, I was like this. <laughs> I can't believe I did that. I did that for real? That's crazy, mom. And that is the end of... Exactly. And that's the end of the story. Like I said before, this is a different type of video. I just thought it was so interesting that my mom did this. And I thought it was nice. I love that my mom wrote everything that I did. There's a lot more, but I didn't want to fit into this video because too much information, right? But it's a lot of funny stuff that I thought was in there too. So, but I thought it was interesting of that my mom did all this when I was born right off the bat. Before I was born, she bought the book and she started writing in it and stuff like that. It's crazy, dude. I love you, mom. I love you, grandma. This is a show that I do that. Mwah. Mwah. Anyways, that's the end of the video for today. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. If you guys made it this far into the video, thank you. And see you guys in the next one.